Hello, it is Megan the Trainer, Registered Dietitian, and I have just a quick public service announcement. And that is, pausing is not quitting. So I've had some conversations with some of my nutrition clients, especially as we are now about to approach the holiday season. As this can be a really stressful time, this can be a really triggering time, especially around food. And some of my clients are a little concerned about you know, maintaining their goals through the holiday season or just in general too. So this can be applicable regardless of the time of the year, even if it's the holidays or not. Um, and that is just pausing on working on your goals. Just because we pause it doesn't mean that we're quitting. Pause is not quitting and sometimes it's a really hard mental block to get through because we all want to make progress we all want to be better no better do better be better right and so we want to always be working forward we want to be moving on to the next thing and sometimes life presents itself that that's not a very feasible thing to do or it's gonna be a really difficult and challenging thing to do so I always tell clients like just because we're pausing that doesn't mean that we're quitting and I also kind of liken it to, you know, if, if something else is going on in your life right now, right now might not be the best time to stick to this goal. We can come back to it. We definitely can. Um, but right now we might need to realign. So it's kind of like we, if we're going on a road trip, we can't go to Minnesota and Michigan at the same time. We have to pick one. And then we can go to the other afterwards. So it's kind of the same thing with realigning what our goals are going to be, what we're going to be working on at the time. Um, and again, depending on what life is really presenting to us. The other thing I want you to think about is just because we're not making forward progress um, doesn't mean that no progress is happening at all. Sometimes there's a lot of power and a lot of progress in just maintaining. And I've had that conversation with a lot of clients also. And sometimes life can get, again, get really stressful. And they might not be seeing the same advances on their goals as they were seeing before. But at the same time, if we take everything into consideration, maybe you had a really stressful summer. Maybe a lot was really going on. You had a lot of family stressors. You had a lot of work stressors, you had a lot of friend stressors, and so there is a lot of power in even just holding your ground. So just because we're mov we aren't moving forward doesn't mean that we're then moving backwards. There's power in staying where you are, and there's power in pausing. So again, just because we're pausing, that doesn't mean that you're quitting. And I know sometimes, again, there's that mental block that likes to say that we are quitting, but I'm here to tell you that you are not, and I have two degrees, so I have the authority to say it. Okay. Maybe not, but anyway, now that you know better, let's go ahead and do better so we can all be better.